Hi, Brent Jack here, where tech is made simple. After some of the most recent and latest Windows 10 updates, as many of you know or unfortunately have experienced firsthand, there have been a number of issues and problems that have arisen and were caused by some of these latest Windows 10 updates. Now, one of the latest issues, according to user reports, is that now users are experiencing audio issues as well now after some of these latest Windows 10 updates. Now, I'm specifically talking about updates for Windows 10 versions 20H2 and 20.04, and these updates include KB5000842, which rolled out in March, KB5001330, and KB5001391, which were both released in April last month, and then now the latest cumulative update, KB5000373, which rolled out earlier this week as part of May 2021's Patch Tuesday updates. Now, apparently, it doesn't affect your media that is played in a browser like Microsoft Edge or any other mainstream uh, browser for some strange reason. Your, your sounds, your videos, you know, your audio are not affected if you play your media through a browser. Now, according to user reports, these issues can include, you know, your volume being much lower than usual, audio shuttering or stuttering, and then now especially a half-pitched noise. Now, according to um, Microsoft, some devices that are running 5.1 Dolby Digital may play a half-pitched noise, um, you know, on PCs running some of these latest Windows 10 updates. Now, you know, there are a couple of fixes and methods you can try to address these um, audio issues if you are unfortunately having any of these audio issues. And then, you know, one of the first things you can always try is you can always head over to your settings, update and security. Under Windows Update, you know, you just go to View Update History. And if you know the offending update, you can always, you know, uninstall it through the Uninstall Updates process. And then another um, option you can try is as mentioned earlier, you can always try and stream your video or audio and media through a mainstream web browser or Microsoft Edge, because apparently the audio is not affected if you play it through a browser. And then another method you can try is if you right-click on the volume icon in the taskbar in the bottom right and your spatial sound is off, you know, and if you have the available options, you can always select Windows Sonic for headphones if you are using headphones or Dolby if you have it and any other available options, you can just try fiddle around with those because apparently that may um, stop the um, audio problems occurring. And then if any of these, you know, don't work, then what you can also try is you can always go to your legacy control panel and you just click on sound. And then, you know, depending on what your audio output uh, device, you just select that, mine is just speakers. You click on properties and if you go to enhancements you can just fiddle around here by enabling or disabling some sound effects and apparently this could also fix the issues now none of these are guaranteed but there at least are some steps you can try as workarounds if you're having or having any of these audio issues mentioned and then if none of these methods work then you will have to wait you know obviously for a fix from microsoft or the optional preview build update that will roll out in the latter half of this month, May 2021. I hope you found this video useful. Once again, thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.